Han Singh Desi. Uh, thank you very much, Madam uh, Chair. A key finding of the Education Select Committee is that use of terms like white privilege may have contributed to the neglect of white working class pupils. What utter nonsense. White privilege isn't about kids from poor white working class backgrounds not being disadvantaged. It's just that their disadvantage won't be based on the colour of their skin. The crux of this issue is that continual cuts and lack of government funding for the likes of uh, free school meals uh, and else leaves all kids from poor backgrounds perennially pushed down. I usually have a great deal of respect for the Honourable Member and his select committee, but does he feel a sense of shame or guilt for having facilitated such findings, which itself drew from a much discredited report from the Race and Ethnic Disparities Commission to try to inflame the Tory culture wars, gain newspaper headlines and further stoke divisions and tensions within communities. Robert Alton. Um, well, I have great respect for um, the Honourable Gentleman and uh, I think he's, he's a remarkable MP, and, but I completely disagree with uh, what he has said. And, and let me just make it very clear, the problem with white privilege, using this terminology, as uh, it, uh, is, is ever spreading, is, for, is wrong-headed for three reasons. It's wrong-headed because it implies um, a collective guilt when individuals should be responsible for acts of racism. It's wrong-headed because it tars every community, disadvantaged communities, white working class disadvantaged communities, as white privilege. And it's wrong-headed because it's factually incorrect because every, uh, uh, almost every other ethnic group does much better, uh, that are on free school meals, that does much better than their white working class counterparts on free school meals. And he's mentioned the funding issue. I have campaigned for more funding. I had uh, all the time. I, we did a previous committee report on asking for a long-term plan and more funding. I had an article in the Sun newspaper two weeks ago calling on Rishi for more, the, the Chancellor for more uh, uh, funding. But the crucial point is this, everyone is under the same funding regime. Why is it that with uh, almost every other ethnic group under the same funding regime that he's talking about performs better than uh, other uh, uh, than white working class boys and girls on on free school free school meals and and just to, again I quote um, the former education secretary Lord Blunkett a man I hugely admire Labour part very respected Labour party uh, figure he says and I quote to put it bluntly the last thing that young people facing disadvantage need to hear is anything about white privilege hope support guidance above all adult role models are what all of them need wherever they are they are from so i would suggest my friends if he doesn't want my the honorable gentleman if he doesn't want to listen to me or look at our report in its entirety i suggest he, the sitting he, he is listens suspended to what until 150 until 205